Our boys got a gameplay for you here. We're starting on offense, but I'm in Chargers. If you guys want to get that ebook, it's in the school community. And then we're also using a new defense that I'm going to be dropping in our school community. I think I actually have it in there, uh, but I am going to be updating it as well. Uh, three three Cub. I think three three Cub is really good post patch, and uh, there's a lot of good things you can do from it. So we're going to be in that a little bit. But uh, starting out here, just want to try to see how the old Chargers offense is looking post patch. Uh, I actually hate the uh, the little put the name in the middle of the screen thing. I don't, I don't know why they why they thought that was a a great idea. I'm going to try this RPO from Trips. I don't know if it's any good or not. We'll just see. We'll just throw it out there. Just kind of see what happens. I feel like Dollar, uh, honestly, because when they do the double safety walk down, one of the underrated things that I feel like happens is it's not as good against, uh, against like, slot screens like that. So, anyway. Uh, half slide to the right. See what happens. And... Uh-oh, I didn't mean to throw it to him. <laughs> I meant to throw it to the streak that was running wide open. Uh, that's, I'm getting old, I guess, boys. Okay, he, he's still running free safety zone blitz. He just doesn't know. So high ball. Yeah, buddy, high balls are not patched in Madden 25. I can tell you that. You can still throw high balls. You just have to basically – the biggest thing with the high ball that I see is you have to have, like, perfect accuracy. I ag that. Heck yeah. Ags are good for Madden. The fact that you don't drop anything in this game, <laughs> like contested catches, I feel like you just catch so many contested catches in this game. That's one of the most underrated reasons why offenses kind of overpowered. So one of the reasons why 3-3 Cub is really good is for kind of two things. Um, the Sun 5 is really good out of it. I think the Sun 5 is still uh, – it, it's not a blitz that you're going to like – it's not a blitz you're going to run a lot, but you're going to run it enough that they have to block their running back. But press man-to-man -man is really, really good uh, in this game. I think it actually got a little better post-patch. So we're going to be talking about press man-to-man -man and uh, kind of scheming around that. And then the other thing that got good is uh, match match coverage is pretty good post-patch. So I'm going to be dropping a, um, a match a match ebook. Let's go flood. All right, I'm gonna have to have to call timeout. Might have to call timeout here. Okay, Ivan Pace. Let's see what I want there. Let's go Pat Tillman there. Jerome Baker there. Clowney and Taylor. All right, we'll just start like that. Of course, I still have to call timeout. I, I called my play. Oh, <laughs> good old man, twenty-five. All right, let's go. Let's put Kendricks there. We'll just see how this goes. So, okay, so Mike Blitz. I think my auto are. Do I have base? Oh, I have baseline on. I need to take that off. Let's uh, coach adjustments. Auto flip on. Auto alignment default. Actually, man line option defense. Conservative. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Look at that man. Look at that man coverage. Now we didn't <laughs> we didn't get the pressure, but uh, we did get pressure. We just didn't get keep contained. But look at that man coverage. That's what I'm saying, guys. This this man coverage is is really 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 good. Shoot, I keep getting clicked off though. Uh, okay, that's just <laughs> – all right. Yep, good read, buddy. All right. Okay, there we go. That's better. Is that open? Okay. I don't know how that's open. But just basic press man, I feel like, is really, really good. Throw purple out here. Of course, I say man coverage is really good, and he's kind of moving the ball on me here. Let's just kind of mix in a zone. How's that? Not a <laughs> All right. 
Just a great read from Air Jordan or whatever. Wear Comp Low. Comp, wear Comp LOL. Just a great read, buddy. All right. There's a lot of holes in this coverage. Oh, that was a pick, too. Here we go. This is good D. This should be really good defense. No. Uh, oh, I said it should be good defense. I gave it the touchdown. Oh, man. I, <laughs> I hate when people call predictable plays and it still works, even though I know the play and I know where to use her and I just step up. I was just one little half step behind and it's a touchdown. Ah, uh, that was frustrating. I should have just, I don't know. I feel like, too, one of the things that I'm starting to notice post-batch, and it was already a thing, but I feel like quick snapping is so, like, pre like everybody does it. Everybody quick snaps. It's kind of, this is one of the first years I've played Madden where I feel like, like, you don't have to really have a ton of complicated adjustments to be good. Like, you can just be good. There should be a touchdown. Oh, my gosh. What just happened to me? <laughs> All right, let's just, let's just streak the tight end and be done. The way he's playing defense. Hmm. Hopefully you're noticing the runoff. Oh, is there no runoff? There was no runoff right there. I wonder if this is like a head-to-head uh, -head thing or what. It's actually a good switch. Just didn't make the play. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I thought, but kind of surprised. I thought there was a new runoff deal. Oh well. Love to. Okay. Bunch strong. Let's just put everybody on a streak and just see what happens. He's in a cover 3D. Oh, he's not in a cover 3D. He's in cover 4 that time. All right, let's watch the runoff here. See if the see if the thing's working. Oh, it's not. Huh. That's super weird. That's super weird. I, I thought that was a, huh, I guess there's not. That should have been a pick too. The stupid bumping in this game. Oh, the stupid bumping in this game. He's just giving me the scramble. What, 30 yards on this drive, I'm scrambling. Let's see if this works. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. That's in the ebook. That's in the Chargers ebook. So, as far as offenses post patch, it's kind of hard. It's kind of early. Um,. I feel like Chargers has still got everything you need. It's got it's got a good – it's got kind of the best of both, Bunch Strong and Bunch Nasty. Like the things that you need that makes those formations good, Chargers has both. Like you have Flood, Corner Strike, Dagger. And then once we get uh, Hot Route Master 2, you can Hot Route Wheels and stuff. So I think that makes Chargers like for the long term probably the best book, best offensive book. Some people are going to stay in Bears. Um the problem with Bears is it doesn't have any auto motion plays. And I feel like man coverage is still going to be good. And so you kind of want to have some, some auto motion plays. All right, here we go. 
actually got our setup in, so hopefully we can play defense. And of course, the this time the zig the zig works. Sometimes the zigs work. Sometimes they don't. I think I'm gonna start shading outside. I think I'm gonna do that. Oh, oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> he must have hit the wrong button. I don't know. <laughs> Thank you. The zig was open again, even though I shaded outside and underneath. But shaded underneath, man. I think I'm going to send five more, though. I want to kind of test man coverage, even if you don't shade. Because I think that could be, maybe that's what I'm not. I don't know. Let's just snap the ball. There, I got a red, but I ag caught it. <laughs> oh, that's good for bad. Oh, man. And on that note, he's out of here. <laughs> All right, we'll, we'll play one more. All right, boys, game number two. Again, we're going to be in CB inside package. It totally messes up everything, so you kind of have to redo everything. Let's see if we can – and you probably are going to have to do the pause deal. Looks like my man's going to be coming out running some wing pair. The thing I really like about 3-3 three, three Cub, just conceptually as a, as a good defense, is – it it has uh, it has match coverage in it too, so and it's a really good run defense. And you can always do just the basic shift and crash. Um, we'll tight end attack early. So you see here, like that's a pressed that's a pressed man up, but I'm not shading. And I have not seen those. I've not seen it get bombed yet. Obviously, you know you have to kind of be mindful of some things. Let's actually run some match. I want to test this audible. Okay. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Very good. And 3 3 Cub also gets really good sheds. Like the best sheds in the game, in my opinion, are 6 1 and Cub. So, could be, could be a really good, really good defense for us. I'll 3 wreck this guy. Give me the pick, please. Nobody can catch a pick in this game. Uh, pick artist is going to be the most important ability in this game. Pick artist and KOs. All right, we're going to send five here. I'm going to shade outside. And he catches that. Mm -hmm. That's the one downside of main coverage is they catch stuff like that. And I might I might just run match this game. This might be a match game. One of my favorite ways to blitz out of – of course I say that and I ran on. Let me show you one of my favorite ways to blitz out of match coverage. So I have my defense set to man align. And then you can even in, in here – I guess I can't. That's so dumb that I can't do that. Um, but I got cover four, right? So I'm going to blitz all my linebackers, and we go quarter, quarter, half. So we got this cover two sink on this side, and then we have kind of that match coverage on that right side. I think this is one of the best ways to blitz out of match. As you see, everything's bagged. He's going to try to throw that too. Is he going to outrun me? Oh, he got five yards. He got six yards out of that. That is terrible. That is absolutely terrible. I might just run match this game. I bet you I almost guarantee you that he runs, he runs his uh, – RPO, no. Yeah, see, this is pretty good defense, guys. I mean, you see the blitz comes in. The blitz comes in against a lot of stuff, and it's very simple. It's That's what I like about Cub is it's it's just a very simple defense, but you can do a lot of stuff with it as well. Get that hook curl off. There we go. Good defense. Fourth and two. He does not like to send five. All right, we're not going to make the same mistake this time. I'm not going to play man. Although he is in quads, so we need a shade. Okay, now we're running RPO glitches. Yep, yep, you deserve That's That's deserved. You're going to out here juke and do stuff like that where you glitch the contains, get popped. All right, let's go score. 
But I think I, I do think like match and man coverage are going to be really good in this game. If can I high point that, oh yeah, oh yeah. Uh, match and man coverage are going to be really good in this game. The thing with four strong is you can't really run match, so that's where man to man is going to be helpful. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Look at that. That's a hard flat. <laughs> I probably didn't even need to do that. All right, I need to stop calling this play. Let's go to Dagger here. Oh, okay. I can't outrun his contain. Wow. Okay. I don't know how that happened. Cover three stock is just the best defense in the game. I'm throwing this corner out no matter what. <laughs> Got to throw that no matter what to get them to, to get them to play it. All right, let's get back into this. Olave, such a good RPO. Yeah, I think this might be. This is probably one of the top five RPOs in the game. You have Bunch Strong, you have one of the top five RPOs in the game, and you have the motion wheel plays. So you just have a lot of a lot of good stuff in this book. Let's see here. Go my seam streak. Okay. He just played perfect. Can I throw this? Just catch it. Thank you. No huddle, no huddle, no huddle, no huddle. Gonna run cover three every play. We should be able to score. He did some crazy man coverage. I don't know what that third did, but <laughs> that's a touchdown. <laughs> I think that was man coverage, though. All right, we got our one stop for the game that we probably need, and we got our seven, and we get ball at half, and we're in a good spot. Three three cub. I'm telling you, three three cubs got some stuff, man. If he would run more bunch, uh, the match coverage is going to be really good for, like, tight compression because it basically just takes away corner routes, and then you can switch stick on the crossing routes really well, and then the quarter flats will also play wheel routes really well. So you've got kind of some of the mainstream, like, routes that you want to – you'll see you're going to be able to counter with match coverage as long as they're not in bunch strong, which is, again, you know, why – All right, because of the way he's playing, we're going to contain a little bit. Just try to keep him in the pocket as he throws right at our face and we can't catch the pick. Called a jet sweep there. Let's just run this. I really feel like this is just this is just solid D. Yeah, just basic. It's just basic, boys. It's just basic, but it's going to be hard for them to move on it. The reason why is because you can't just bomb the man coverage anymore. A D. I think that was a four man. Let's take a look at that heat. Can we get that pressure? Yeah, watch this, watch this. This is four. Oh no, that's no, that was five. That was five. Never mind. Good. Yep. And you see, I mean, the beauty of this is, like, you just – even if you get picked up, the pressure still is there for you. It's a really good defense. Thanks for watching the game plays. And uh, if you want to check out the 3-3 Cub defense, it's in the school community or the Chargers offense. Both of them come with a membership. Ten bucks is links is in the description.